Hey, what's up, guys? It's D Brown with Trackheads, and today I like to welcome you to. I want to say it's an episode per se. It's not the usual workout video that you usually see me do. It's more so like um, I have a que- like someone asked me a question, and the question was, you know, hey, uh, you know, D, you know, I'm I'm trying to lose weight. I'm trying to get in shape. You know, what I'm saying it's the it's it's currently the fall. It's no longer summertime. You know, how can I get in shape? Not just get in shape, but like diet wise, what can I do in my diet to stay, to stay, you know, fine? You know, I may not be the runner that, you know, uh, runner running every single day, um, you know, but what can I do in my everyday diet? And, you know, me coming as a track and field athlete, as a cross country runner, things like that. And I'm sure you other cross country track and field runners can uh, attest to, you know, there's a lot of diets, you know, a lot of diets that we learn, you know, a lot of positive um food habits that we learn throughout the years of us running right um that have us in like tremendous shape every single year or every four years in the olympics when they look at track and field athletes we are the epitome of fine as hell you know what i'm saying we are the epitome of in shape we are the epitome of like you know when you look at what a human being should look like in its most like athletic form we are that definition so um you know, I don't want to make it too complicated. I don't I don't want to give you all these like high tech definitions of what you should be doing, what you shouldn't be doing. I'm basically going to break it down to like maybe a couple, maybe like two or three points and things that you should avoid, um, especially if you're not, you know, a track and field athlete. So check it out. Number one, I feel like the number one thing that you should be doing is avoiding, you hear me, avoiding white foods. OK, this isn't a racism thing. This is a this is a real thing. Avoid foods that are white, okay? This is white rice. This is white bread. This is um, you know, you you have to. Basically, it's like this. There there are like two kinds of carbohydrates, right? There's great carbohydrates, like good carbohydrates. There's fruits, um, vegetables, um, things of that nature. And there's also bad carbohydrates. They are the cakes. They are the um, sweet things like sweet foods. They're breads. They are um, those kind of things, right? And what happens is, is that when we eat these food carbohydrates, we use them as a source of, our bodies use them as a source of energy, right? But that is only um, conditional if you burn the energy. So imagine if you have, um, think about like a gas tank, right? You're filling your car up with gas, carbohydrates, food, and working out is basically getting the gas down to back down to eat, Okay. But imagine if every day you're filling up the gas tank, filling up the gas tank, filling up the gas tank, but you're not working out and the gas tank just continues to fill and fill and fill. That is a is a metaphor for like how the body consumes carbohydrates. So what happens is the the less, you know, the food that you don't burn, that you don't um, burn through running or exercising or whatever the case is, it gets stored in your body. Right. It gets stored in your body as fat. So your body converts those carbohydrates to sugar. The sugar then turns into fat. And what happens is you just start getting bigger and bigger. You start to get a little bit, you know, chubby. You start to get them love handles. You start to get a little bit fat in areas that ain't, you know, too pleasurable. They ain't too, you know, you ain't. You start to look bad. Okay. So many, in so many words, you start to, you start to gain weight. And it's not the pretty weight. It's not the fine weight. It's you start to gain weight um, because your body starts to store fat. Um, for survival, you know, our body, our bodies learned how to store energy in the form of fat for our bodies, you know, in case, uh, you know, we have to hibernate or something, you know, just body evolves over time. So long story short, you have to stay away from those white foods. Okay. Stay away from those white foods. Stay away from those foods that are really high in bad carbohydrates. Okay. Common sense. Just stay away from the pot. Like, you know, people always talk about pastas, right? You know, for cross country track and field, yeah, I know if you run the 400, 800, 1500 and up, they always tell you to carbo load. You know, they always tell you to eat pastas, eat spaghetti, eat meatballs, all that stuff. Why? Because we, when we run our 5Ks, we are burning a tremendous amount of calories and our body uses that as energy, glycogen. It uses those carbohydrates as energy, right? So it's important for us to have high amounts because we're going to empty out the fuel tank within the next day or so. But if you're eating pasta every single day, if you're eating um, things that are high in carbohydrates every single day, your body's gonna store that as sugar and the sugar is gonna turn it to fat and it's not a good look, okay? So 
that's like the biggest thing that I can really recommend in terms of like the amount that you, you know, uh, to, to help out with your diet. Just avoid carbohydrates, you know, um, and, and, and you should be good, all right? I, I said I was going to drop more than one point, but I think that's like the main point, okay? Control that diet. Um, take carbohydrates or limit, you know, the bad carbohydrates out your diet. And honestly, you should be good. I don't see, you know, um, too many people not benefiting off of that tip. All right. So with that being said, I think I'm going to be dropping little nuggets here or there for my for my folks that are trying to lose weight via diet. OK. Um, but yeah, guys, with that being said, it's D Brown with Trackheads. Like I said, I'm going to be coming with some new videos pretty soon. Definitely check it out. Uh, if you haven't already, like, subscribe. Add yourself to the channel if you have any questions that are related to training, related to diet, related to anything like that. Definitely let me know in the comment section. Um, if you have any ideas for any videos, definitely let me know. You know what I'm saying? And I appreciate you definitely so uh, your support and you watching uh, my video. All right. So with that being said, it's D Brown with Track Kids. Peace.